Hello, I'm Natalie Dupree here for PostandCourier.com, and what we have here today is stuffed squash and zucchini, and it is so delicious. It's easy too, and when you get really tired of zucchini, it's a welcome treat. It also can be made ahead and frozen. Um, not perfect, but it's pretty darn good. So when you have a lot of them, do that. Now what I have here are squash and zucchini. It doesn't matter. And you want to cut them in half and you want to cut into the squash. Of course, squash is a zucchini, or zucchini is a squash. And just hollow out what's in here. Just scrape it all out. And you can use various things. Sometimes, just depends on the size. Sometimes I use a, a, a peeler and kind of dig away at it. Sometimes I use a knife. But most of the time, I just think that this is the, using the spoon is the easiest. So there we are. It's hollowed out. Don't bend the outside. If you bend the, if you break into the outside, then go ahead and chop it up the way I did here so that you can put it in the filling itself. So here's this. Now, the trick to getting this tender. You can either put it in a little uh, water, put it in the oven with a little water around it to kind of steam it, or I just pop it in the microwave for about one to two minutes until it's soft enough that when you bake it, it'll be lovely. So you saute the innards and any messed up ones that you've got. And then you go ahead here and, well, maybe let's put in a little bit of breadcrumbs, just enough to kind of hold it together. How about some cheese? How, how much could that hurt? And of course you would season it to taste. And then you just pile it right into the boat. Now you can do this ahead of time. It's really nice for company. And I like a little of the green showing uh, just because it's pretty and so forth. You can add fresh herbs, of course, too, if you'd like. And then what makes it so fabulous on the table is then when you're ready for it, you mix together just some, some breadcrumbs and that can be panko, by the way. And you dot, you sprinkle with the Parmesan. You, um, just trying to get enough to show you one. <laughs> and you just sprinkle on the top of it. And then dot it with just a little bit of butter. You know, enough to make it taste good. Now, if you wanted to be decadent, you could put pecans in there. That'd be maybe for a holiday. But put it in here. Now, this whole thing can be assembled. And when you're ready for it, pop it in a 350 degree oven. I do mine um, in the little toaster oven for my husband. So it's kind of a temperature of on or off. But it works just fine and it's easy that way then for just two people. Or you can multiply this up for a crowd. Do it all ahead, pop them in the oven and they come out, you'll see, bubbly and delicious. Okay, I got one half out of the oven. Actually, one zucchini st stuffed is really enough for just the two of us. But as I said, you can multiply it up. So here's our stuffed zucchini, and oh, it's really one of my favorite things. Do try it. I'm Natalie Dupree, here for postandcourier.com with stuffed zucchini and squash.